All right, welcome back everyone to episode six of John and Eric's adventures into Skyrim. So we are here, we're over encumbered. You can see it right, right here by about 300 carry weight. We are back here, right near or outside of Falkreath. I looted all of the stuff that we got from the last video. Um, we gave Eric his brand new shield. There he is, Eric with shield. Um, not too much armor, right? A lot of good steel stuff that we're just going to sell. Um, so it is 7 a.m. So we're going to wait one more hour. We'll pack this up. We'll wait one more hour so that all of the shops open. We're going to sell all of our goods. And then we are going to return all of our quests here. Keep this active. Yeah, Valheim Towers and Silent Moon Camps are still a little bit too much for us. And the Vigilance of Stendar. Hopefully we'll come across one of them. Right? But right now we're going to sell all of our goods and return them. Well... We don't have to return to Farkas or sell all of our goods. We we can wait to sell our goods back in Whiterun. But I'd like to run around and explore Falkreath a little bit, and we really can't do that while we are over encumbered like this. And so what we're going to do is we're going to attempt to... Well, I don't think there's any beggars in this town at all that we can talk to. So we'll talk to the smith. Load off all of our metal goods, and then we'll sell the rest to the general store. That will give us a little bit more freedom. Damn, spooky, isn't it? We'll go and look at the graveyard too. Steel's good, but loyalty's better. Take a look. Yeah. <laughs> Dang right. Let's see. Anything good? Uh, nah. Iron, steel, some scaled equipment. Moonstone. Gold, oh, gold ingots, wow. Aren't too common, you don't see those everywhere. So we have plenty of gems. Here's all the stuff that we're selling. Right, all the steel, shields, the leather stuff. We might, we might break down all of the leather stuff because we can use that for our smithing training. That's our limiting resource. And I think that's what we'll do is sell those. Plate boots are pretty good. I don't think Eric will use them though. Because we handed all of this to Eric, and he is currently wearing everything that he So, scaled equipment will sell, right? And then all of the aerial stuff here. Um, first saddles. Yeah, I ended up finding these. I don't really want to break them now. We'll just sell them instead. But you can see the uh, a lot of these aren't really worth that much gold. Maybe this is. Right? This might be worth selling the gold. Sell that too, sell this. How heavy are these? I think we'll just sell these because they're pretty heavy. Oh yeah, we managed to find a necklace of water, right? That was pretty good. We just got a speech level up. So, and then what else? Yeah, some, some bolts sticking out of our chest. And then we just slam it down on the counter like, I'd like to sell this, please. Okay. Okay, bro. <laughs> Yeah, we have a lot of silver arrows that we managed to get too. See me at my forge if you need arms or armor. And what we will do is break all of these down. We'll start with the leather, right? We want to get more. So, oh, these are the uh, cloaks that we have. We have a bunch of cloaks that we can break down. Get plenty of. Here, can we just kind of quickly start at the top? There we go. Quickly bust our way through those. Nothing else we have that to, to really break down that I can see here. We want to keep those cloaks, or at least we're going to sell them. And then we'll store all of our leather on them. have all of our ingredients. Anything else like that. Still above carry weight, though. And I believe the solution is going to be to sell these cloaks. So have these shields too, but we can just sell those to the general store. What else? A couple of books, right? Some large animal bones. Store all of those, right? We didn't end up using this. 
Uh, and we'll put away the tent because that will allow us to start moving a lot more effectively now. Oh, uh, we'll just ride over. Uh, well, before we do, let's see how the Jarl's doing. Let's see if he has any quests for us, right? Goes up. Now that we've cleared the road down to Falkreath, I think it'll be helpful for us to begin. I see, protect do. the Jarl, oh. whoever that might be. I'm the steward here. I serve what do you, what do, you do, Nenya? Jarl Dendir before him. Nenya business? Well. Wisdom, forever light your None of my business. Yes, what is it that you want? I'm looking for work. Work? I demand tribute before you can be considered for any real tasks. How about drink? None of that local piss. Real Blackbriar mead, fresh from Riften. Okay. You better. I hate people who waste my time. Okay. Come and see me again sometime. I might have some use for you. Dang. Um... I don't know if there's anybody else in here that we can speak to in regards to the finding always work, looking for strong, capable right? warriors. I'd like to become a Legion commander? Well, wouldn't we all, right? Yeah, one one thing about Falkreath, right, is that if you're a thief and you want to find some good stuff to steal, like, they just leave stuff lying around here, man. They, uh... really doesn't ha seem to have any concern for, like, security or well-being of his people. I mean, Helgen... Helgen technically is part of Falkreath, and so... Oh, man. It's always been a little bit surprising that they never talk about the, uh, the dragon attack. Where is my horse? Oh, it's over there. Okay, I was like... Just have it follow us back. Um, let's see if there's any Blackbriar mead in here. Right, are there any... Quest one. Hunt a fugitive in the reach. I'm telling you, I heard it. Howling. Those werewolf things are true. Werewolves. Okay, if you say so. I mean maybe, who knows, but who you Oh, did you need something? Keep a song. No, in we're your all set. Ward off the blue. Thank you, but welcome to Dead Man's Drink. What I'm really looking for... What did we come in here for? I'm totally blanking. Um, right, we need Take ale. A look. Black Briar Mead. I do not see any Black Briar. Have any beef stew? No, how about raw beef? Don't see any of that. Alright, do you have any mammoth items? Old wine, though. Predator's price, so a couple, a couple of good things, right? Snowberry wolf chops, those are pretty good. Range brew items, venison stews, okay, so. Terrible. Hear any juicy gossip in town? Be sure Need to something? Ooh. Take a look. Wandering trader, okay. Ooh. Elven cares of major health for 2,000 gold. Wow, pretty good. Let's see, why don't we just sell her all of our miscellaneous stuff that we have here? Ah, oh, I bugged it out. Take a look. Uh, yeah, we'll keep our silver greatsword, right? Eric's already wearing one of these. Sell that and the Imperial Shield. Uh, this is so lightweight, we might as well just carry it in case we need to do any like water breathing, I guess. And then we'll quickly sell all of them. Great. How about these? Sleeping tree sap. This could be really good for emergencies to the point where I'm actually going to sell our Altonoir wine, which was, was our, uh, our health buff, and use this instead. So that's just like an emergency instant 100 health heal. There's plenty of healing potions. We'll use poisons. Smithing fortifies three points. I guess we'll hold on to that. Just fire. So this stuff's pretty good. Dread Zombie. Uh, Reanimates very powerful bottle. Very powerful. Speed. Sell that. And then yeah, that looks good. All right. Until next time. Dropped a bunch of carry weight. You. 
What do you do? Need something. Oh, he's probably just one of the followers of the uh, caravan, right? So let's see, we can double check on how our... What is word? I'm sorry, I should really go now. Wow, that... You need to stop smoking, ma'am. She looks really good for her for her age. So I did accidentally trigger the uh, quest that was down here, right? Strangers like you bring war. I've seen enough war. Oh, okay. Nice, nice to meet you too, bro. Dang. What's our time on our blessing of Arcade? I say we just renew it, right? Maybe we'll get some extra favor, right? So we're almost, we're up to 50% favor, basically, which is pretty good. A little coin I've... always greases the Oh, boots. okay, so Eric, Eric's getting his, uh, his gold up, right? Here is the Priest of Arche. Anything in here worth taking? Probably not. Uh, come into Arche's life in the end. There's no need Looks like we're allowed to take these, so... Ooh. Some eggs, we'll take those too. And again... I don't know, I don't know exactly why, but... I can only assume it's because... John here... Must have seen a sign written somewhere that, that we don't see saying, Oh, help yourself, right? You take the antlers. Salvage the wood pile. We uh we we could use a little bit. We could use some practice. So we're going for it. You never know what we might find inside. Hey, gold. Not bad, right? Just kind of coming by, hanging out. Great. Let's have some uh, some eggs for breakfast here. I'm thirsty. Nothing quenches your thirst quite like a raw egg. Eat. Do a chicken's egg too. And oddly enough, I seem to be doing okay. So I'm looking for the the priest. Priest. Goose is responsible yes. for the cemetery here in Falkland. I take care of the shrine. Um, can you teach me about restoration? I'll teach you some of what I know. Oh! Be careful. Nice! We found a restoration trainer. Hell yes! That's pretty freaking good. We're definitely going to be using restoration magic later on, so... Uh, are oh, you yeah. a priest of Arche? We came into Arche's light after the Great War. I'm fortunate that Koost and the people of Falkleaf have come to Koost accept is name. on okay. their own. Could you do an old elf a favor? I misplaced my journal in a cave I was exploring. Yeah, we should Lesson be able to do that. Take a look. It's got for sale. That's always interesting, right? Eh. Uh, that's. <laughs> that journal means a lot to me. Look for it. Here, you kind of have a, uh, a B problem here. We'll take care of that. Yeah, this is a really big graveyard, by the way. Like, it it really goes on. Like, it's, it's big. Cool. Can't see. All right, let's grab our horse. I think we are all set to head out, right? We'll take some of the nightshade with us, though, because... We are gonna head back out onto the road. Ugh, get to it. Oh, okay. Wrong way. Hold on. You can do it. This way. Yes. I think. I wasn't expecting my horse to follow me this way. There we go. Hell, have a great night. Thank you very much for dropping in. And we are going to uh, quickly head to Whiterun, or in that direction. 
I'll see if we come across anything interesting. All right, so we're we passed by these roadside ruins before. And I think we might be able to take on whatever's inside. I don't really know exactly what's inside if we go in here, but it's... Oh, okay. All, all right. Le ooh, ooh, level 8 Spriggan. We could do that. Two dead guys here. I think we could do a level 8 Spriggan. Oh. Where is it? Come on. Take him out. We bring it all the way down. Oh, come on, come on. Ooh. Wow. How was that, right? And we got a level up, too. That could have been really bad if we ran out of stamina. Eric, you okay? Quickly harvest some ingredients. Alright, he's all set. Oh, I got some wood out of it too. Wooden taproot. Yeah, these guys don't seem to have been so lucky. So let's uh, let's see what they have, right? Some skooma. Nice, we'll take the, the sword. We'll rip apart all of their equipment. We have enough carry weight, so why not, right? Iron, eh. So let's break it down. Break down the steel swords. Then their plate. These. Uh, oh yeah, fur. The fur armor, right? The cloaks we sell, but the fur armor we break down. Ingredients we can. Also, it's. Oh, there we go. Looks like the, the weather's improved significantly. Very exciting. Got, got a mountain flower. Whoa. Weapon enchantments. Thank you very much. Then an apprentice level lock. Oh, oh. and all the birds in the background. It's nice. Valkyrie oh. 3 really is a nice place to, to hang out when you're not struggling to uh, open a lot. Hey, there we go. Ancient bows. Mm, that. Kind of hot garbage. But what the random dead butterfly wings? Why are there so many monarch wings here? Not that I'm complaining, but is this like a ritual thing, right? So many of them. Goodness. How many did we just pick up? We didn't have any before, I don't think. Monarch wings? We had eight? We just picked up eight monarch wings. They were just kind of laying on the ground. Dang. Yeah. Well, they give tap roots. Do we have any ingredients that we picked up that we have to learn the uh, traits for? I don't think so. All right, let's do a level up, and then I think we're we're actually going to quickly head back. We're going to put five more training levels into restoration. Because having a higher level restoration is going to be really helpful fighting the undead later. And then we're going to continue right on to the Valkyrie. So first we'll figure out what we're going to put this perk into. That is a good question. We have heavy armor, so we can't really do sneak. We could put another right into there. Could invest it into block, which might be a really good idea. Let's see if I can cast my spells 
wearing heavy armor. So we're going to do a quick save here. I want to see if putting the perk here allows me to cast my healing aura on Eric. Oh, it does. And I missed him. But that's okay. So we can now, we now we don't have to switch over to um, our robes that we have here every time we I want to cast those spells. So that is excellent. And what we'll do is we'll jump on the horse. I'll go train in Falkreath, get five more levels, and then we'll continue on to right one. White run. That's our plan. All right, and we are back at Whiterun. We encountered some uh, revelers. We managed to trade a running brew mead in exchange for a very nice new charmed necklace with 1,000 gold, right? So it helps you see straight even when you're drunk. So that's nice. But otherwise, nothing really happened, right? Normal ride. <laughs> we heard some mage fight explosions. That was terrifying, but... Otherwise, we made it safe and sound. Up off the wood that we looted, and all of our crafting supplies here. We're gonna bring them in and put them right by the fox. Hopefully, all that stuff doesn't despawn. I mean, I, I don't think it will. We enter White Run very frequently, and we're gonna use it. I think the despawn is one month. So it shouldn't be too much problem. Worst case, you know, stuff gets stolen, right? So what can you do? What can you do when your supplies get stolen? We have all the mammoth meat and you know, stuff, right? 66 leather strips. Lots of her plates, and then Not we're gonna bad, quickly the craft these into steel bars. Yes, They're heavy, they weigh three each. Uh, anything else? No, we might uh, grab beef stew. So much mammoth meat. Problem I have. I am merely an apprentice. Oh, I, I keep getting them mixed up. Let me see if we have anything we can quickly sell here. I, I like to keep two bows just in case we accidentally have one destroyed until we can upgrade to a uh, higher quality one. Yeah, the ruby gold ring we'll get rid of. Um, I think we're gonna sell the charmed necklace too. But we're Good luck. Here. E why don't we do it here? How's it going? Take a look. Don't forget to check inside. We're up to sixty-four hundred gold. Nice. So we recovered from the uh, the training that we purchased a little bit. Good. We're still wearing. Wow, that was really far zoomed out. Yet yeah, we still have all of our armor equipped. Something weird happened, where for some reason I attempted to do a healing aura again, and it's not working anymore. So, it seemed like the perk worked, but then it stopped. I don't really understand exactly what happened, but it's pretty disappointing. Oh well. Let's see here. Hunt East March, Hail. Kill the leader of all time towers. I do all time towers soon. Where um Amran's sword is, isn't it? Krypton's the opposite direction. Dragon Prince Solitude. There. Hmm. <clears throat> well, we'll keep those in mind. And let's sell all the last of our junk here, and then we're going to go trade in our very last quest. Welcome to General or our um, companion's quest. Everything. 
trinkets, odds and ends. Hello, Smell Thor. I'm here to sell these. And yeah, those, all those are fine. That's fine. Uh, we'll sell this book I found. Small animal bone that's kind of cluttering my inventory here. We're just going to make more kindling out of the firewood that we have. And, uh, yeah, that looks pretty good. We'll use amber for anything, so we'll just get rid of those. But I like keeping all of the flawless gems. Do come back. Because they don't weigh anything. And you now we just kind of have them in our gold bag. We can use them for crafting. We can use them for emergency gold. There's a lot of things we can do. We're also going to go in. We're going to buy beef stew. We're going to see if he has any mammoth. Probably should have checked to see if Bellathor had any. Well, we have like ten more mammoth, right? I don't think we really need that much. Good to see you again. Drink for the thirsty, food have for the hungry. Beef stew. Thank you very much. And then raw beef. No raw beef. It's okay. Anything mammoth? No. Oh no. Be careful out there. All right. Thank you. Hey, wait a minute. Need something? You know the Alakir warriors are looking for a Redgar woman? Are you sure? Oh no. They found me? I need your help. Please, come with me. I need to speak to you privately. All right. Quickly, All right, we'll... Come with me. <laughs> we'll start this then. We'll listen to what she has to say. John and Eric are aspiring adventurers, and we want to help people, right? But on the way in, we saw that, uh, those Alakir warriors, and so when we saw Sadia, we, we had to say something, right? We were like, hey. So, are you working with them? You think oh. you can take me? You so much as touch me, and you're going to lose fingers. I mean it. I'll, I'll cut you in half. So the Alakir know where I am? It's nice to be what do they offer you? Spot. Gold? How many more of them are coming? Tell me. Relax, we're and not going to hurt you. And there isn't anyone else I can trust here in the city. All right. Um, perhaps, yeah. what, what do you want? I am not the person that the people of Whiterun think I am. My real name is Eamon. I am a noble of House Suda in Hammerfell. A noble? The men who oh. are looking for me, the Alakir, they are assassins in the employ of the Almeri Dominion. They wish mm -hmm. to exchange my blood for gold. I need you to root them out and drive them away before they find me and drag me back to Hammerfell for an execution. Uh, they're mercenaries. Careful back there, Eric. For the money. They're led by a man named Kamatu. Get rid of him and the rest will scatter. I don't dare show my face lest they recognize me. So you'll have to find out where they are. Uh, any suggestions on I how I do that? I was just arrested trying to sneak into the city. If he's locked up in the jail, perhaps you can get it out of him. Please. I know I'm asking you to do something difficult, maybe even dangerous. I just don't know who else I can trust. Hmm. All right. Find me the moment the Alakir are taken care of. Sounds like a plan. What we'll do is we'll we'll turn in that other quest. We'll pick up uh, our next companion's quest. Then we'll go talk to this Alakir and right. See what he's up to. Get a get a you know feel him out a little bit. Hello, friend. Uh, oh, thank you. Have, have some I candy. Your kind heart. You tried mercenary work? No, we already did our training for this level. I, find that so I remember. Yes. Oh, that's uh, the the merchant who does magic. Yeah, and we do have to go inside a turn. So. The jail's like up around the side of. Uh, the cloud just like, oh, hey, there he is. Skior says that I have the strength of Ysgrimor, and my brother has his smarts. No more problem. I expected no less of you. And once again, you have not disappointed. Eight, 800 gold, wow. Um, nice. Until next time. Some people don't think I'm smart. Those people get my fist. But you, I like. Talk to the companion's leaders for work, right? I'm looking My at Farkas here. Is a better uh, than me. He should be okay. Someplace. That's kind of strange. You, I like the smaller you still need to prove just work. in time. I was worried I'd have to do this myself. Some rich folk had a trinket stolen. 
and they want us to get it back. I, can get I tell you, this province is losing its grip. Let's the bandits become more brazen every day. Bandits? I'd be able to do that. Where are they? It doesn't say, uh... Mm -hmm. Where, though? Well, that's a little bit interesting. I'm, I prefer to figure out, like, where they are. Thinking I need to... Looking for We've work. gotten a letter about someone needing some muscle right nice. here in white. Now that's what I'm looking for. I don't know what the fight is. I just need you to go out no more than that. I don't want to hear about a kid. I, I can understand. deal with that, right? Go. Bring honor to yourself and the companions. All right. Who do we have to beat up? Beth. All right, we'll go beat up Beth, right? There's a delivery quest for that as well. So. At least we're not being a, hurt, a murder hobo today, right? Dylan was talking a little bit about that. Where, uh, looking at implementing the new professions, um, I guess quest line is technically what it is, allows you to do several other miscellaneous side quests, such as uh, filling crafting orders and things like that, that help you advance your skill while still getting some needs of gold. Which I think is fantastic. It's very exciting. Here we are. Dungeon. The dungeon where they store all the people that try and break in to the, t to the town. Um, that is one hell of a name. If I remember correctly, the person we're looking for is right here. Buddy. What are you looking at? Need to find Kamatsu. Where is he? You have a death wish then? If you know that name, you must know to meet him would be to meet your end. But it seems we both have needs, friend. Perhaps we can help each other out. Okay, what do you need? I have dishonored my brothers by being captured. So they have left me here. My life with the Alakir is over now. But I have no wish to die in this god's forsaken land. Fair enough. If I can be released from prison, I may start over. See to that, and I'll tell you what you want to know. How much is your fine? 100 gold will secure my release. Oh, okay, that's not bad. You can afford that, can't you? I suppose you'd better hope you can, if you want the information. Get the money into the hands of one of these guards, and I'll tell you what you want to know. Uh, okay. Good day. Seems fair enough. Oh, that's Eric. Hey, it's Broski. Nice. I no. want to pay that prisoner's fine. Convince him to stay out of the city while you're at it. All right. Excellent. Hold on. He has to... We have to patiently wait for a few scripts to operate here. Yep. You buy my way out of here. Yep, I'll your fine's been paid. Very well. Kamatu is west of White Rock. It's an unassuming little cave called Swindler's Den. You realize if you set foot in there, you're never coming back out. They'll kill you. Oh, really? That's your problem, not mine. They're gonna kill me? Guard. Fine's been paid. Now set me free. Yeah, we're gonna get killed. Sorry, my ears aren't so good. You say something? I said my fine has been paid. Now let me out. Right, right. Oh, look at that. I seem to have lost my keys. Might take me a while to find them. You just sit tight. I'll get around to it eventually. Curse you! <laughs> Uh, gets them every time. Oh, they'll let him out, right? Right? I think they'll let him out. I mean, I, I never actually went and checked, but I always assumed that eventually they let him out. So, we... What we got, right? South Fringe Sanctum, I'm pretty sure, has, like... Necromancers in it that will rip our faces off. One black briar mead, we can grab that too. Um, uh, uh, talk to them, kill Kamatu. Woo! And we can grab that other happy little quest off of the wall on a potion delivery. And we should be all set. 
I really should go into, um, what is it, third person when I do those jumps, just to see, right? Potion for Riverwood. Oh! Potion right in here. Excellent. Oh, I can harvest those. You. Oh, I'm here for the delivery. So you're interested in my potions and ingredients? Have any good ingredient, good or rare ingredients that we'd like to grab? Your heart. Grab the uh, the giant's toes. Valuable. Mammoth hearts are pretty valuable too. Mammoth heart, and giant's toe. It would be nice to learn the uh, the traits of it, but salmon row is pretty good for water breathing, so I think we'll buy those too. Just because void salts are still a thousand gold. Yeah. And then the wheat here is so cheap, we're just gonna buy it. Anyway. Be careful out there. Okay. Onward to adventure. So we can do, go do the combat first. I say we do the combat first. That'll be much more exciting. All right, we'll keep our episode short. So we will take on Swindler's Den. I think we'll do the whole quest. What we'll do is we'll, we'll do the entire quest. Here, uh, which means, that means we are going to need some and a plus two. Our buffs up, right? Put on our healing poultices when we get outside there. And then we'll beat the crap out of everybody in Swindler's Den. Sounds like a plan. Alright. Alright. We have arrived, Swindler's Den. It looks like somebody here isn't exactly too happy to see us, right? I don't know where Eric is. Uh-oh. Eric's stuck on a thing. Eric, can we give you a uh, healing aura here? We're not in combat, technically, so... Giving Eric the uh, the healing aura is significantly more important than having it on ourselves, because when Eric gets it, he can get up from combat. You know, with with us it's important too, but for him, if he's knocked down, he'll be able to get up faster. All right, bring it on. Now ain't this a surprise? That's it. Piece of cake. All right, we'll perform RK's rights. Poor guy. Now, what did he have on him? Lots of iron stuff, right? Well, we'll take those. Is that it? Some, uh, some. He had some emergency cheese. We'll bring our horse a little bit closer here, just because. Want her to get stolen, do we? There we go. Alright. The very last thing I'll do is put a healing aura on myself. Because it is regenerated and just enough. Nice. What I really need to do is hotkey all of the armor that we have here as a uh, a quick key, right? One of the uh, quick options. I need to figure out how to do that, and that'll. It's, it's my homework for later, I guess, right? Alright. All of our buffs are up. We're gonna make quick work of this, and then we're gonna go back through and loot. So, I'm gonna use this. Idols, ivory, luster fades, and you feel no effect. Oh. We didn't get the effect. 
Whoa! I can't see anything. Whoa! All right. We will start with a smaller one, right? Oh, we have a superlative, which is pretty good. Do that. We can't help. How's Eric doing? This place is dark, man. Whoa, okay. Hello. Eric, help. Oh. Alright. Let's take out that bow. Oh. <sighs> All right, how we doing? How we doing? It's like our health is good. Eric, where are you at? Eric, where are you at? Eric. Eric, this way. Come this way. I mean, at least he was shooting some arrows, but dang, man. Eric is going to kill us all. Alright. There seems to be a time limit on, um... That's interesting. Can't seem to do RK's rights on this guy. Whoa. You're fighting. Oh, okay. Who are you? Alright. Uh, oh, yeah, should have blocked that one. Run! Oh, nice. Maybe it's because we're still in combat. Where are they? Here, then this way, I think. Whoa! Ah! Here, we need a potion. Whoa, I heard that. Ooh! Oh, crap, okay. They were right around the corner there. Ooh. All right, anybody else, anybody else? All right, we'll go up top here, see if we find anyone. Anyone. Eric, how'd you get up here? Remember him running forward? Alright. See our quest marker right up ahead.
All right. Very well. Stay your hand, warrior. It's no secret why you're here. And you have proven your skill in combat. Let us talk a moment. And no one else needs to die. I think we can all profit from the situation in which we find ourselves. Oh, really? My men will not attack you if you will lower your weapons. I've been sent here to kill you. Of course. Sent by. What is it that she's calling herself these days? Shazra? Sadia? One of those, correct? Did she appeal to your sense of honor? Your greed? A more base need, perhaps? It doesn't mm. matter. No doubt she's convinced you that she's the victim. But do you know why we pursue her? Uh, your assassins. Assassins? No, nothing so crass. Sadia, as you know her, is wanted by the noble houses of Tanith for treason. We were hired to see her return to Hammerfell for her crimes. Treason. Help us with that. And make sure no one else gets hurt. What was her crime? She sold the city out to the Aldmeri Dominion. Were it not for her betrayal, Tanith could have held its ground in the war. The other noble houses discovered her betrayal, and she fled. They want her brought back alive. Mm. The resistance against the Dominion is alive and well in Hammerfell, and they want justice. What do you want me to she do? She trusts you, at least to some extent. She sent you after us, and has no reason to think that you do anything other than that. Convince her that we'll be coming for her, and she needs to leave. Lead her to the stables outside White Rock. We'll be waiting to take her into custody. I'll gladly share a portion of the bounty in return for your efforts in seeing proper justice done. All right. Good. It will be good to finally be able to return home. And if he betrays, oh, if he betrays us, we'll take him out instead. Good news is we're still allowed to loot the stuff at the end. All right, some robes, some other stuff here, bedroll, lo 25 lockpicks, what the heck, right? Some gold. So we'll take all these, right? Nothing super exceptionally amazing, but so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna go through, I'm gonna loot the whole place, and then we will head back to Whiterun afterwards and we'll continue on the quest so i will see you soon more exciting than bard songs all right we are back inside and we are going to elsadia what is up and if we can get to her Goodness. right here any news of the alakir Yes, I wasn't able to defeat what? them. They're coming. How? I thought they weren't allowed within the city. They found a way in. They're coming. Ah! Where do I, go? I can't keep running forever. There's a horse waiting in the stables. I'll make sure you're safe. After all this, I have to pick up and leave again? If you really think this is the only way, I trust you. Let's not waste any time. All right, then. All right, let's do it. Go. Oh. Go. Sometimes she gets bugged out on how fast she travels, so we're gonna skip forward to where we're outside and running, just because. All right, we're back. We're cruising now. There was a, uh, she did get stuck for a little bit. So we get to see a beautiful, beautiful sunset while we're running through here. So I'll have to keep close. We'll see how it all goes down here at the stables, right? And if there's any funny business, we'll have our weapons ready. We meet at last, my dear lady. What is this? What have you done? Oh, come now. You didn't really expect to manipulate people forever, did you? Your luck had to run out sometime. Damn. He doesn't look too happy. Now we'll take our friend here back to Hammerfell, where she will pay the price for her treason. You won't be harmed? Not on the way back. Once she gets there, it's not up to me to decide what's done with her. 
And as for you, I owe you a portion of the reward, don't I? Well, here you go. Spend it wisely, and if I may, don't allow yourself to be fooled by a pretty face. You're better than that. 500 gold. Mm-hmm, until next time. Hmm. All right, and I think there we have it, everyone. That is going to be the end of today's episode. So we learned a valuable lesson, or John and Eric learned a valuable lesson. I don't, can't just trust a pretty face. We managed to take out Swindler's Den. We got a bunch of new stuff. We're going to be crafting it all uh, once we get back inside to Whiterun. And then with our new gold, we have about 8,500 gold. We're buying a new horse. Looks like very good. Thank you all, all very much for watching. Have a wonderful day.